Colts tight end and Hoosier native Kylan Granson working hard to collect more than 10,000 books to donate to Indianapolis Public Schools. He did launch this four week book drive earlier this month with the help of Kroger and Granson's nonprofit KG's Kids was created to emphasize education starting with reading. And that's why the book drive is so important to him. Look who's back. Kylan is here with an update on how the book drive is going. And I think it's a like big surprise it's coming today. Good to see you. I just love that you're giving back in this way and that you're um, on the show and that you make time for us too to tell people what you're doing. Um, can you update us on, again, where you stand right now and just how important this is to you? Oh, well, for sure. We've had a really great book drive so far. We had an amazing kickoff event up in uh, Olio Road and Fishers. Um, we raised over 750 books at that okay. that location wow. on that day. Uh, we even had a former Colts uh, player, uh, yeah. Marlon Jackson, stop mm -hmm. in with his family. Aww. So it was great to see him. Um, but yeah, I got to meet a bunch of people, talk with a bunch of kids, and it was a great event. Um, also, before the event even started, I had the opportunity to talk with um, in front of the uh, Kroger store managers yeah. okay. and they raised over a thousand books themselves. <laughs> so they really killed it and it was it was a great event. Um, and I also got to speak with a hun the young hundred men of, of black men of Indianapolis. Yeah. And they were a great group of kids. I got to talk to them just about my experience, my journey, offer some advice, and they mm. raised over 500 books themselves. 500 books, like all of these books. different groups, yeah. Santa, right? Let me, <laughs> let me join with you and do this. So um, again, tell me before we get to the next little surprise, how many books do you have kind of like as of today or as of this morning? So as of right now, we have over 2,500 books. Okay, 2,500 yeah. in just a short period of time, but this big news, you're getting this huge donation later today, and what is it? The Knights of Columbus have <laughs> absolutely knocked it out of the park. They've donated 15 Ooh. pallets what? worth of books. Yes, yes, 15 pallets. Uh, the estimation's over 5,500 books, so that should be that should put us just under uh -huh. two. 2,000 to go, and yeah, they I, it's incredible. I hadn't seen this photo yet. So when you see it like that, that wow, that puts it into perspective. How are these books gonna get into kids' hands? Or kind of tell us those next steps. All right, so we have this event. Uh, it's, a, it's our second year doing it. It's called KG's Carnival. It's kind of like a book fair, but mm -hmm. the kids just to come in, they get to come in. We have like decorations, we'll have snacks, mm. and they get to pick five books that they're choosing, whatever books they want. They get to take it home for free and it's theirs. I remember as a kid, you know, when you go to the book fair. Yeah. I mean, that's something that we all remember and think about. Mm -hmm. What a great thing for you to do too. What is the, um, maybe the last little piece of important advice or something that you want people to know, whether it be if they want to still donate a mm -hmm. book or why to you, it's so important for all of us to read to children. What do you want them to know? Um, there's just so many important life skills you get from reading. Yeah. Uh, reading comprehension is just a number one thing that you can take away. Also, it improves your vocabulary. Mm. It starts important conversations mm. at home. Um, and that's why I'm so passionate about it, getting these kids started off at a young age. But also, um, if you guys haven't had a chance to donate yet, uh, we have our uh, KG's Kids okay. website, and we have a link there where you can go and donate. Or you just stop at a local Kroger store. We'll have a drop-in box. You can drop off some books you're willing to donate. Love it. You, both of your parents are educators, so I know that's maybe kind of why, um, another reason why it's still important. Okay, can I just do something really quick? Because when you're talking with your hands, I want to just see how big your hand is compared to mine. Oh, yeah, can yeah. I just do that? Okay, because I'm like, <laughs> I'm noticing how, like, I was like, wow. <laughs> I just wanted to, like, and, yeah. you know, sometimes we think of things when we're here, but good yeah. to see you, nice to see and I um, appreciate all that you're doing for our community and for the kids. It's 845, fox59.com slash links if you'd like to help Kyle and I. I couldn't resist him, <laughs> and I'm like, it, wow. Yeah. Yeah. What a great cause. I love the idea. Great concept. All right, 845.